I suppose I have imposed upon your sensibilities quite a bit in my last few videos. Well, I'm back to imbibe upon them again. <laughs> Today I will continue with my speech about future people, future people, the ones that in our timeline do not exist yet. I am talking about people 250,000 years or more in the future or even five years in the future. I call them the future people. Now the thing about future people is that they exist. <clears throat> to our way of thinking, they are not yet born, or they're very young, or they've got 250,000 years to go before they exist. Now, I am here to tell you that they already exist. How is that possible, Boog, you say? How is that possible that a person that has not been born exists? Well, now we have to go into time and talk about time. Um, let me make this as simple as possible because I know this is kind of strange stuff for you, right? Like, uh, <laughs> well, First of all, you have to realize that time as we know it is a false uh, concept of time. Well, it's not false, but it's, uh, it's the kind of time that was set up to work in physical reality. However, time in general is something that... Uh, the scientists are still trying to figure out, and they're getting close. The best way I can explain how time works, <coughs> the best way I can explain how time really works is to think of a thing like the spacious presence. The spacious, all that is. The spacious, um, well, let's put it this way. Everything exists now. The past exists now, and the future exists now. So, for instance, this speech that I'm blabbing out to the internet right now, it exists for me right now. And the thing that you have to get in your mind is it also exists right now 250,000 years in the future. I'm not sure how I can really explain this situation, but uh, Think if you take a, a pool shot, you, you get your pool cue, and uh, you're going for the eight ball, and you take a shot at the eight ball with your white ball, and you sink it into the corner pocket, and you win the game. Okay. Now, you think that is a sequence of events. A sequence of events. However, all those events are occurring at the same 
time. In the bigger picture of time, which scientists are still working on, and they haven't gotten it quite right, I wish they would listen to me, because I could explain things in a very simple matter. For instance, think of a book that was written back in the 1920s or 30s or 1800s or way back in time. You look at it as something that occurred 100 years ago or 150 years ago. However, that book is being written right now. That book is being published right now. That book is going onto the bookshelves of stores all over the place right now. So, what I'm here to tell you is time, time exists only right now. There is no beginning. There is no end. There is no creation of the universe that happened billions of years ago. That creation is going on right now. Um... This is a very hard concept for some people to get across. But let me, let me make it very simple. If you make a YouTube video, or if you write a book, or if you write a poem, or if you write a song, or if you go jump up and down uh, by a tree somewhere, and if you record it, if you record it, people 250,000 years from now are watching it right now. They don't have to wait. Like in our concept of time, they you would think, oh, it's going to take 250,000 years before somebody will see this video I made at that time, but no, they are watching it right now. I call it the spacious presence. The universe is being created right now. It is not something that happened billions of years ago. In the greater scheme of time, Everything exists at once, including all the probabilities that stem from our choices. It is quite a simple, simple little thing to grasp, but, uh, oh boy, then scientists are slow. And one day, they're going to look back and say, Boogaboo, how did you know that? How did you know that this stuff was going on? <laughs> how did you know that all time is one? <laughs> well, all you got to really do is look beyond the obvious. Look beyond the obvious and uh, uh, well, that's all I can say on this subject, but um, I'll make a few more videos about this. But for now, all you got to remember is all time is one. And we'll work from there. We'll work from there. Hey, buddy, we'll work from there. <laughs> it gets very, very interesting. <laughs>